Hi, I'm Dr. Karen Leong. I'm a board-certified plastic surgeon practicing out of Newport Beach, California. Breast implant illness has become a really hot topic over the last couple of years. And I've seen a shift in my practice where I used to see more breast augmentation patients and now I'm seeing patients who would rather have their implants removed because of this concern for breast implant illness. What is the true incidence of breast implant illness? That's a great question, because at this point, it is still a subjective diagnosis. There's no medical verification or data supporting the entity. We are not discounting breast implant illness. It is a thing. Women suffer from having implants, but not all women do, and not all women feel better even if they have their implants removed. So when I'm asked how common is breast implant illness, it's kind of a hard question to answer because it's based on your own experience, your own concerns. What I can say is if you have an autoimmune disease or a family history of it, we do make sure that you sign the consent stating that you are aware that you are at higher risk for developing breast implant illness.